Welcome to North Carolina Wine TV Non Food Friday. Non Wine Friday. <laughs> I am your host, Kit Bodner. And I'm your other co host, Jeff Cohen. He's sick. <laughs> I'm sick. And because I'm sick, we're not having wine or food on this Friday. That's right. We we had wine yesterday, but it was it was an older show. Mm-hmm. And so we decided that we were not going to do a new pairing of food and wine today. Not with that wine, or not with another wine. And, and the reason for this is because Jeff went to the Egg and Valley Wine Festival. He's got some awesome wines lined up for us to review on the show. We're really excited about it. But I can't really taste anything right now. And so I felt it was going to be an insult to any of those winemakers, or be unfair to any of those wineries. So instead, we decided we would tell you all about a little something we have coming up. Yeah. Instead. And tell folks what that is. Whole Foods Market in Durham, North Carolina is having a fall harvest dinner with local food and local wine. And guess who they asked to help pick the wine from North Carolina? Us. These guys. Us. So it's essentially a North Carolina wine dinner That's at right. Whole Foods in Durham. And it's on Saturday, November 7th. So if you're in the area on Saturday, uh, on that day, uh, we hope you join us. It's a three course dinner. I think mm -hmm. the price is $30. Yep. Uh, you can register anytime between now and then at Whole Foods in Durham. Um, you can't make it to Whole Foods in Durham, but you want to come to the event, I suggest give them a call. They probably have a form or something, I right. think, that, they could, that you could fill out uh, to attend the dinner. Um, but supposedly, it's going to be lots of great food options. We're mm -hmm. going to be working with them. Uh, helping them pick out a couple, a few wines that are going to yeah. go really well with the food. And so North Carolina food, North Carolina wine, uh, a great way to, you know, kind of get into the November fall season. That's right. It, it's at 7 p.m. Something that I'm a little curious about because we haven't actually met with them yet to talk about the wine. The, the information, it says choices of beef, mm -hmm. chicken, seafood, or vegetarian. Yes. Yeah, so... They are having all of those options, so yep. we're going to have to find some pretty versatile wines that mm -hmm. work with all of those yep. those different options. So I'm really looking forward to it. Uh, Whole Foods in Durham does some really great food. Yeah. Uh, they ha actually have a, a very good North Carolina wine selection, mm -hmm. um, so we, uh, we look forward to working with them. We hope that we'll see some of you out on November 7th at Whole Foods in Durham. And next Friday, all going well here, we will be back with a... Food and Wine Friday That's instead right. of a non-food and wine Friday. That's right. And one last thing, uh, there's some bottles somewhere. Which way are the bottles? I'm bottles little, are that way. Bottles down there. Um, here, here's the thing. Twitter, Facebook, RSS. Um, there's a new bottle there. Kip doesn't know about it yet. There's a new bottle. There's a new bottle. What's check the bottle it. for? Well, check it out. It, it might make some, some people who carry things around in their hands happy. Love it. Yeah. Love it. Check out the new bottles. Yeah. Um, thank you for all your support. We, we really appreciate it. We, again, we hope to see some of you at Whole Foods on November 7th. Uh, and until then, we don't have any glasses to clean it out. So but here's air clink <laughs> to the Old North State.